second is on the way. No good. Ball is loose. 10 seconds to go. Mercado with the ball. Looking for a chance to tie. They're going to get it to Mendoza. Mendoza, good defense on the back end. Two seconds left. Long three-point tip is good. This game is tied, and we are going into overtime. Was that a two or was that a three? It looked like a two from They April. called it a three. They will call it a three. Folks, you're going to have to watch Go it. Go to the replay. Go to the replay. Regardless, Justin Lopez stepped back and hit a contested three-point attempt. And we start from zero, Mr. Gantu, with four minutes to play. We are tied 46-46 overtime when we come back. Well, as the buzzer sounds, folks, we are in overtime. High school basketball rules, we have four minutes. Second overtime, if needed, would be on the way in the event that the score remains tied. Right now, that we're locked at 46-46. After Justin Lopez hit the shot of his life, a fall away three-pointer to keep this game tied. Things you gotta watch for, though, the Gladiators were only four, I believe it was four for nine down the stretch in the last two minutes from the free throw line. But one thing you have to look for, dear Gladiator fan, is they have to keep the intensity up. It's really easy for McCullum to keep that momentum going. It's going to be a lot more difficult yeah. for the Gladiators to Definitely, start Definitely, because over. they've been the ones playing from behind. Good call there as number 30, Alex Loretta, tried to draw a charge. Did a nice little Shaquille O'Neal impression, flop to the floor, and he'll be called for a block. <laughs> In case uh, you were wondering, <laughs> You're wondering, that's the uh, Suns versus the Orlando Magic a couple of nights ago. I do watch sports in Mr. Cantu, although sometimes, if this one goes sometimes. any longer, won't be able to see it tonight. Diaz. And the free throw rolls for the Gladiators continue as that one rims out. Second one is good. One point lead for the Gladiators, 3.50 to play. Mercado to the lane, runner, no good. Diaz, big rebound underneath. Loose ball though will be picked up by Hinojosa, trying to dribble out of traffic, will wisely give it up to Tyler Garcia. And that's certainly a mismatch you'd like to see for Tyler. The He's ball back to Diaz. That ball to the strip. Tyler's going to follow. Diaz with the block on the other Oh, my goodness. Loose. Falling down. We're going to get a travel? No, we're going to get a foul call on the other end. And Lujan will go to the line to shoot, too. I'll tell you what, though. That was a outstanding block. You might not see anything better than that from a high school Did. basketball player as Diaz Did. got all the way to the other end of the floor. Put that one off the back He uh, dropped the bomb on that one. Lujan to shoot two. And a rare miss for the Cowboys. Gladiators must focus here on getting the rebound if Lujan misses the second. Second is up here. Hinojosa with a big time rebound. Ball comes back up the other way. Back down to Gomez in the ball game now. Three minutes to play, we're at foul underneath. It's gonna be on Julio Garcia underneath. <laughs> Didn't really see it from my angle. Called it as a push all way away from the ball. Happened all the way on the other side of the court. There's nothing more to say but horrible, horrible, horrible call on that one. Uh, Seemed a little ticky-tack to be giving away so far from the ball, but either way. I, I can't imagine that that sends Lopez to the free throw line. We might need a rule clarification. I think on offensive fouls, they do not go to shoot the one and one I could be wrong, though. We're about to find out. And maybe they don't know either. I guess I'm right. Mr. Yeah, Mother. I mean. As McCollum will take the ball in the other end. Earn your points, McCollum. 47-46. 
Gladiators are all leading by one with three minutes and three seconds to play. Moving the ball around, Mendoza looking for that shot. He'll give it back out to Lopez. I'd Lopez. stick to him like Lou if I were you. I, the way he's been playing, he will shoot it. No right hesitation. Now, right now they have Gomez on Mendoza trying to set up a little mismatch. Mendoza looking for a shot, will pull it back out. Back out to Lujan and again, back out to Lopez. 2.20 to play halfway through this overtime period almost. <laughs> Only one point on the board so far. Those that thought about it will give it back to Mercado. Two minutes to go here in the first OT. Good defensive stand though by the Gladiators, not giving anything easy. Halfway through the overtime period, one point lead for the Gladiators. And McCullough's going to be patient. What they're going to do is just wait for the perfect opportunity. They do not want to force a shot. And why would you? At this point, they feel like they are playing up on us. 